What's up everybody? Today we're bringing you the plans for this cool three-tiered rolling plant stand. This is a really cool little piece. It's got three tiered for different types of pots and it's got rolling swiveling casters. So if you want to move it somewhere else, you just move it somewhere else. This is a really fun little project. It's an easy build. We'll show you how we did it and show you how you can roll into the free woodworking plans to make one for yourself. So this entire project was built with a half a sheet of plywood, which luckily I had on hand. So then we used our Craig adaptive cutting system to rip down the sheets of plywood that we needed. We ripped these down into the pieces we needed and then used the miter saw to cut little angles on the boards that serve as the posts in the front and the back. Then it was time to drill our pocket holes. We got out our Craig 720 Pro pocket hole jig basically our favorite tool in the shop. This makes making furniture so easy. Each of these shelves got screws to go into the post. I really love drilling pocket holes in plywood with the 720. It is so easy with their Automax clamp system and it makes it very, very quick and simple. And then it was time to start construction. So we started with the larger lower shelf and attached that into the straight back post. Then we moved to the middle and the top shelves. We used a speed square to make sure everything was at a perfect right angle and got everything nice and level and repeated that on the other side. Then it was time to add the angled posts. Originally, I didn't think that the top shelf was going to connect to the angled posts, but once I realized that it would, I clipped on the Craig 520 jig and drilled some pocket holes on each side of the top board. Look how easy that is. Didn't have to take it out and redo it. Just clip the jig right on. Then we added those angled posts, pivoted it off the top, and then screwed it in flush on the bottom, screwed it in on the middle and top posts as well, and then we were ready to do it on the other side. Once all the shelves were in place and everything was dry, we added a layer of waterlocks finish on top. This is going to be outside on our screen porch and is also gonna get water on it from watering the plants. So we wanted to make sure we had an outdoor sealant protecting it from any elements. After everything was dry, we added casters. These are just two inch casters. They roll and swivel and lock, which is good. We have toddlers, they like to push things around, so we're gonna have to keep these locked. We added four casters into each corner and then we were ready to roll. really love how this project turned out. It was a really simple project with plywood and it's going to be so useful on our porch. Morgan is obsessed with plants as you can see and we have lots of potted plants at any given time. If you want to get the free woodworking plants for this project to build one for yourself, make sure you go to charlestoncrafted.com and check out the blog post.